these are the switches I just um, mounted and the rack so I originally configured the stack to be uh, five switches but I found out we have an extra patch panel so I installed six switches but that's no big deal I just got a new switch and what I need to do is just one simple command I have to add to the master switch so here I have a console connection to the switch um, let's do do show run Type include provision. See here, we have five switches provisioned. All I need to do is just add one more. So I'll just do switch six provision. And I'll just copy the same model. And now we have six switches ready. So, right here, I have the stacking cables. I will be connecting them and showing you how to connect these stacking cables. So these are the switches from the back. Right now I only have the top switch powered up and other switches are still not powered up until I connect the stacking cable. So when you connect the stacking cable, these are the ports. Let's say this is A, this is B. A from the first switch will connect to B on the second switch and then a will connect to B on the switch after and then A to B, A to B until the end. A will connect back to B on the first switch to close uh, the loop. And how you want to connect these, you see here the Cisco logo, it will have to be upright this way and you have to tighten the screws really good. So this is the first cable. I will connect the rest and show you. I finished connecting the cables. So this is the first cable, second cable, third cable, fourth, fifth, and then we will order a long cable to connect the bottom one to the first one. Okay, I will will power the other switches up and we'll see how the stack forms. So all the switches are up now. And we have the fiber connections, the uplinks, two of them, and the top switch, you see here the active LED. Um, means it is the master switch of this, uh, of this stack. Let me show you the console. So here is what I had before, before I powered up the other five switches they were all provisioned but nothing's ready now if I do show switch they all show ready ready the top switch the active one um, has priority 15 I set that manually so that it uh, it is active every time we, we uh, reboot the stack okay thank you guys for watching